We have like experienced a lot. So in, in terms of like our lifetime and like the huge transitions in humanity, so like the coronavirus, uh, cell phones, internet, 9-11, like the, yeah. the, the crash of, um, what year was that? 2008? Yeah, yeah. 2008. It's just like, holy shit. That's like a lot to, to work through. But honestly, I feel like our, this generation is very strong and resilient. Mm-hmm. Yep. We are, I mean, we have no choice to be. Seriously. I mean, I I gotta get up and I gotta move on. There's shit so out of our control with this. And it's like, at the end of the day, all we can control is what we're being told to do and stay home. And if you're fucking sick, don't go outside. I mean, there's just so many things that are just pretty obvious to do. So follow the instructions and this will, Mm -hmm. this will pass. Who knows what the hell is going to happen when it does, as far as people's, you know, money and back to work and like all of yeah. that stuff it's gut-wrenching to think about and I try not to because it can like just like hurt my heart for like some of my friends and yeah why so I, I try to not think about it too much yeah because if you think on it it's just like I keep saying it'll consume so I get you it. And then too much it's thinking too much it's fucked up <laughs> and I just got I sit down I'll just crush these foreigners trying to get into the USA I'm like this is not happening now after this corona thing you guys no one's going to be able to get to get into the USA yeah (laughs) 